Hey guys, it's Emily. In this video, I'm going to show you how to make these wooden bead ornaments. Let's get on with the video. The first ornament I'm going to show you how to make is this round wooden bead ornament. You want to start off your ornament by getting a piece of floral wire that's any length, but you want it to be a little longer so you can tie it later. The length of my floral wire is 12 inches. And you're also going to need some beads. Then you want to take the floral wire and round it. After you're done rounding the wire, you can put as many beads as you want on the wire. And make sure you leave enough room so you can tie it. I put 18 beads on mine. When you're done putting the beads on the wire, you can tie the wire, and don't worry, you're going to cover it up later and make sure you keep it round. You're going to want to tie the wire like this. Then you can place the wooden beads on a piece of cardstock paper and trace it to create a circle. Then you can cut the circle out. After you're done cutting the circle out, you want to place the beads on the circle and write a word or a few words in the middle of a pencil. I wrote the word JOY in capital letters. Then you can take the beads off and go over the word with a marker. When it's dry, you can erase any pencil markings. Now you want to take hot glue and put a thin line of glue on one side of the edge of the paper and stick the beads on it. Make sure you glue the metal piece that's showing at the top. Then you can lift up the other half of the beads and glue the rest of the beads down to the paper. When you're done gluing the beads to the paper, you want to tie a piece of string in a loop on the metal piece that's showing. And if you want, you can glue the knot of the string on the metal so the string stays in place. Then you can tie a bow with any color or size of ribbon and glue it on the metal piece to cover it. You can also glue on a bell in the middle of the bow and then you're all done. The second ornament I'm going to show you how to make is this tassel wooden bead ornament. You want to start your ornament by getting a piece of twine that's longer than what you want your ornament to be and tie a loop at the top. Then you can put as many beads as you want onto the twine. I put five beads on mine. Now for the tassel, you want to take a piece of cardboard that's about the size that you want your tassel to be, and you want to wrap the twine around it about 20 times. After you're done wrapping the twine on the cardboard, you want to take a piece of twine and run it through the loop and tie it at the top. Then you want to cut the twine you are wrapping with at the bottom. 
And then you want to cut the twine in half at the bottom. Then you can take a piece of twine and loop it over the tassel. And then you want to wrap the twine around about 12 times. When you're done wrapping the twine, you want to cut the twine you are wrapping with and you want to take that piece of twine and run it through the loop that you made earlier. Then you want to take the twine that's from the loop and pull it so it creates a knot. Now you want to trim off the extra twine from the knot. And you can also trim the bottom of the tassel. When you're done making the tassel, you want to put a bell on the twine that's attached to the beads. Then you can tie the tassel onto the twine. And if the tassel is too long, you can trim the tassel to be shorter. My tassel ended up being about three and a half inches long. You can also cut off the extra twine, but make sure you don't cut the twine that's from the knots too short because they can come undone. The last thing you can do is that you can tie a bow with any color of ribbon above the beads, or you can also tie it underneath the beads. And then you're all done. And that's how you make these ornaments. In the comments down below, let me know what you think about these ornaments. And subscribe to see more videos. I'll see you in the next video. Bye!